The slip and slide provides a frictionless surface for which to do experiments. For example, we can test momentum conservation. Momentum is given by the mass times the velocity. So if you have a big mass, you will have a big momentum even if the velocity is small. On a frictionless surface, momentum is conserved. So, if a light body and a heavy body collide, the momentum gained by one of the bodies will be equal to the momentum lost of the other body. In this example, we have a heavy body and a light body. So in this case, when the heavy body pushes off from the light body, the momentum transferred to the light body will be the same as the momentum lost by the heavy body. But by virtue of the fact that the heavy body is much heavier, the velocity lost by the heavy body will be much less than the velocity gained by the light body. Now torque is defined by the change in momentum times the radius. In this example, in the face plant, the radius center is at the face and the legs are at the outer tip of the radius. Therefore, as the momentum is transferred to the face, there's a net rotation. In this case, Lexa is wise not to trust her massive mother. Okay, go ahead. Put me in the front. Okay. You can't be in the front. You can't be in the front. Right, I'll play there. Okay. 